Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch, interact and also learn. Your tutor today is Mr. Wanyoike, an agriculture teacher. In today's lesson, we are in Form 3, Lesson 11. The topic is Livestock Production 4. And the subtopic is Routine Livestock Rearing uh, Practices. Uh, to the lesson objective, by the end of this lesson, you should be able to explain uh, how to care uh, care to be taken how care should be taken when handling vaccine and also state the types of equipment used in administering uh, the warmers through the mouth of an animal then number three explain the reasons for carrying out hoof uh, trimming in uh, livestock uh, we have terms used we have dosage uh, refer to the correct amount of a uh, drug that you are supposed to um, to administer in a single uh, uh, administration of the drug. Then we have antihelmintics. These are the drugs which are normally used to control uh, the worms. Or in other words, we can say the, it refers to the warmer drugs. Then we have uh, hoof trimming. This is the process whereby the overgrown hooves are cut or trimmed uh, short. Uh, then we have can uh, in handling a uh, vaccine. Uh, the first one you should provide freezing temperature uh, between a negative 20 degrees Celsius to 4 degrees Celsius because the vaccine uh, sh require to be kept under very very uh, low temperature. Then number two, sterilization of vaccination equipment. Those equipment which are used during vaccination, they are supposed to be sterilized uh, either by boiling uh, using uh, uh, boiling water uh, then you have a correct dose uh, dosage should be adhered to the, the, the correct amount of the drug should be administered then we have routine administration should be followed and if for example it is a, a, a drug which should be vaccinated through the mouth you're supposed to use uh, the mouth but not uh, injection then we go to the equipment used during uh, during the warming and the first one you may use the silage where the vaccine is placed and also you put it into the mouth of an animal for example as you can see it is well illustrated here uh, there is a sheep which is being uh, vaccinated uh, where the, the warmers are placed put in order to control the, the worms then we have uh, you can use the neck uh, bottle where the the, 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 the drug is uh, dissolved in water and also introduce into the mouth uh, into the animal through the mouth then we have the borax gun it is used to shoot the solid drug through the mouth and you can as well as use the drenching gun in introducing the liquid drugs through the mouth of an animal reasons for deworming uh, quality improvement for those animals which are dewormed they have high quality product then the second one to increase the level of production yeah when once you carry out regular deworming it means that the animals will be ready to produce and you will en be enjoying the high levels of production then we have number three uh, to increase the lifespan of an animal remember the worms normally compete uh, uh, for the nutrients with the animal. The, the feed that you normally give to the animal, uh, it is shared by the, 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 by the worms. And therefore, uh, the animal may end up becoming emaciated and to an extent, uh, some of them uh, may end up dying. And therefore, uh, once you eat the worm, uh, the lifespan of uh, that particular animal will increase methods of hoof, hoof trimming you can use the first one uh, the first one is uh, use of a hoof trimming knife and the second one you can use a hoof cutter then the third one you can use a hoof uh, a rasp 
then reasons for trimming uh hoof trimming the first one it is to facilitate movement uh for those animals which are uh, uh where hoof trimming uh, has been done uh it means that uh, the manner in which they move they move uh well without difficulties then to control uh foot rot disease and finally to facilitate tapping when it comes to mating in uh, young animals like goats and sheep the activities for today the question number one define the following terms as used in livestock production the first one is dosage and the second uh the one b is hoof trim you're supposed to define them then the second question highlight any three equipment used during uh hoof uh, trimming for reference you can re uh, refer from uh, the secondary agriculture student book three uh, and the publisher is the kenya literature bureau for more information or if you'd like to clarify something from us at, uh, you can reach uh, us at rim tv using the following uh, uh, contacts the first one you can use the sms uh, using the number which is well displayed for you then you can use youtube also you can use our facebook platform at erim tv and finally you can tweet us at erim tv underscore ke thank you for joining me in this lesson uh, till next lesson goodbye